this food here, gorgeous Dennis, isn't it? Yeah, well, I like it. To it. Oh, it's going to be brilliant. No. Yeah. Mo moving on to the uh, biggest fight of the year, right. obviously in uh, Saudi, Joshua against Ruiz rematch. How do you see it playing out, Dennis? Now, Joshua's favourite again, isn't it? And uh, I think it's 50-50, I think Ruiz can still beat him. Um, and out of, I think, thank you. I think it's uh, still a good fight, and I think in his mind now Joshua will think this kid did a number on me, he beat him. He didn't just beat him, he from down a few times, didn't he knocked him about. So I don't think so. I don't quit. I don't. Yeah, I don't. I don't think it's a very good move when I sound it. He just come for the money. Now he's getting 59 million guaranteed. He's only getting 10 million, isn't he? Yeah. Oh, man. No, no, no. If he beats him, he's in big money, isn't he? And I think he can beat him again. Um, beat him easier this time, I think. But he's, he's 3 to 1 on, I think, Joshua. Crazy. He's going to keep it long, isn't he? I think it's 50 50. Well, what, about, what did you think, Dennis? This is a question from me about the study that somebody on YouTube did regarding the Parker fight. There were 19 interventions by the referee every time he looked like Joshua was in trouble, you know, against Parker. And he kept breaking the fight up, didn't he? Do you think that were embarrassing from the referee did that from England? Yeah. Yep. I think the cannon form. You think what? I think referees can influence the fight. Yeah. Okay. Just a I well, think Parker weren't allowed to, wasn't allowed to go to work. Yep. You think it were all favourite stacked in Joshua's favour? I do, yeah. I do. I, li I like Joshua. I think he's great for the sport. Yeah, he's done brilliant for the sport. He's done brilliant for himself as well, though, hasn't he? I don't think he'll... I don't think he'll stay in the sport a long time, Joshua. <laughs> Nice punch in with it. Got a good brain. I mean, if he don't go the right way, I think he might, he might retire. He might retire, do you think, yeah? Well, he says he's right. He, well, he says he's going to fight back if he loses. But is he pay per view if he gets beat again, Dennis? Yeah, because he's excited. Yeah? So is Lewis Ritson. Yeah. 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 Joshua is really nice. Yeah. 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 So if people are willing to pay, why not? I'd pay to watch uh, I'd pay to watch Joshua. Yeah. I would yeah. Yeah. I, I like um, Pakistan I like to come I would come up too, so I like the lead up to the fight. So yeah, I think it's, it's great for us. Well. You think he's going into this fight knowing that he's gonna get beat? No. No, but I think when the bell goes, he'll be very careful. And he and he'll like try and change his style and like you say, probably keep it long or whatever. Um once he starts shipping odd shot because I think with Ruiz he's got fast hands, hasn't he? So he'll throw when Joshua's throwing and he, and he will be faster because he's had preparation, he's in better shape and uh, he will cut he will cut the distance down a lot quicker. So once that happens and he gets caught off shot, he'll revert to kind and it'll be a slugging match and it's all chins up first. Yeah. Joshua can wipe, he's a good finisher. Oh, I think it's 50 50. Yeah. It weren't before the first fight, it was probably 80 20, wasn't it? And I didn't fancy it was. I just didn't have a big issue of it, didn't I? Yeah. Um, but now, nah. I think he's got a chance, I think he's got a great chance. Yeah. But I think it's like, he's not, he's not odds on AJ, I think, uh, I think it's 50-50 uh, um, who imports himself and who man's first. And, and Andy Ruiz is capable because he's got fast hands and he can whack. 
Yeah. So even though it's smaller, you haven't got the advantage there. So you know, it's more of it just shows if you're good enough, you're big enough. And that's what he brings to the table. And the thing what he brings to the table now is he's got one over on AJ. A massive mental edge. Mm. And he'll not want to make mistakes like when he got caught in round three, will he? No. No, but he knows he's got to take a chance with Joshua. He knows he's under the fact of being gay. There's every chance he'll land quicker if he just when you move up, you move up when you open up. You like that. You watch journeymen, they just come and survive and they have to throw you. Like that, you have to take them there. If you, if you unload, that's when you can get countered. That's when he's vulnerable. Is that when he, what, when he goes to finish him off? Yeah. Yeah, so it's an intriguing fight. It's good. I'll, I'll, play, I'll play 24, but even though I think. 25. Yeah. Yeah, even though they, they shouldn't be doing it, uh, I'll pay it because I'm, it's a fight I want to see. There's a lot of intrigue with it and it can go both ways. So, what's your thoughts? I hope that Louise beats him. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, yeah, he comes back to England and starts again and has some proper fights in England. They've, they've manufactured him, haven't they? Yeah. They've it, swerved everybody, haven't they? Like, they? He were managed as a wilder at one point, Joshua, and he jumped to IBF. Yeah. I think, uh, part of me, like, obviously, I want, I want all Brits to win. Um, but I'm talking to the camera. Okay. One all Brits. Like, um, all Brits, all Brits to win. But, um, only if they're willing to step up to play and uh, and if he fights Tyson and if he fights uh, Wilder. Uh, Dillian White still there, that's still a good fight. I think if he gets beat, I think that is one fight. What they will try and make the rematch because uh, Dillian's knocking on the door obviously for a world title. Um, and if Dillian were to win a world title, obviously a natural is Joshua versus Dillian. But um, even if there wasn't a world title at stake, it's still a good fight. So there's some smashing fights there. Um, but I would like to see Joshua instead of playing politics, not like they do, is uh, fight one of the big two, Tyson or Deontay. So who do you think wins? Out of all them, if they all fight each other again now, it's all intriguing, isn't it? Tyson and Deontay, I think, they're so. Yeah. yeah. Uh, next to Louise and Joshua. Yeah. What yeah. well, did you think about my uh, me saying in June uh, that it's going to be 25 quid on the rematch? You said all bonkers, didn't you? I want to say I said you were bonkers, but uh, you didn't agree with me, though, did you? I can't remember. But I don't know. You're trying to, you're trying to get a, a brownie point here for something I didn't say. Oh, you did then. I didn't say you were bonkers. You said you can't see him for it was 25. Did is that what I said? You said Can you, have you got proof before I? Uh, before we I had a chat about it, and you said, "No, nah, you're just trying you to create a bit of controversy. You'll not you, be 25 quid." Have you, have you got proof that I said that? No, but we were in. Uh, Someone else at top. So you, you might you're just picking a location where we go sometime. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, 20, 20 quid or 20 quid. It's a good fight, isn't it? It yeah. shouldn't be pretty. They shouldn't be pretty. And if you could get away with it, you would get away with it if you could, wouldn't you? So we'd be great, but then you've got to give a bit of value back, but it just seems like it's milk, milk, milk. Yeah, there's no take, coming take, back take. I don't know, I don't know where boxing is going, I don't know, I don't want to spoil it because pay-per-view, David A. knackered pay-per-view uh, a few years ago and he's back. He took for three years, didn't he? Over his toe. But everybody wants to be um, involved in pay-per-view now because that's where the money is for. Look, football squeezes all the money out of sport. Uh, so boxing could do with that, but there's only a few elite fighters who get the big door near pay-per-view money. Now, I know everybody's after 
the pay-per-view fight, but I'm not sure. I mean, yeah, you can do pay-per-view fight, but don't do a subscription as well. You know what I'm saying? No. 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 So it's a difficult one, but well, I, can, I can't help anybody trying to get as much money out of the game as possible. And I think it's probably to a point to, like it's overkill. Yeah. We're doing too much. What do you think to KSI? Logan I didn't watch it. No, pay per view. I'm not interested. Well, interesting. I won't say I'd never put one on, but because he weren't nice, you know, I weren't into just because I didn't know him. I'm, I'm not into the YouTube, I'm not a YouTube trotter, whatever you might call it. Uh, but obviously, but the um, obviously, the, the, the very, very popular, and I can understand, you know, I think, well, let's get it on and let's make some money out of it. So, but I'm a bit of a purist, I'm not saying I wouldn't do it because if somebody asked me to promote, but it's not my first choice, so I'd never say never, but I didn't go out of my way to watch it. What do you think Shannon Briggs getting a million dollars to train the Logan Paul? Paid a million dollars. Crazy. Crazy. But, you know, he, he's shouting from rooftops about everything to get himself noticed. Well, eventually it's paid off for him because he's, uh, he's got himself a million dollars instead of fighting, training somewhere. So, well done, Shannon. What do you think to KSI? Saying that he'll fight Joe Weller now in another five, another YouTuber, and he's got a big following. And Johnny Nelson approaching Joe Weller to, to be the trainer to fight KSI. It's turning into the contender, isn't it? <laughs> what with trainers? They don't milk in it, are they? I mean, but it's a bit of theatre, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pour too much cold water on it. Plus, it's a bit of theatre, and if somebody asks me to train one of them, I won't say no. I'd uh, happy to, but there's an element in the WWE in it. Do you think, that, do you think that's how it's going down? I think it's a bit of theatre what he created, and uh, why not? Why not? Next one, Russ. Right, uh, 